I'm meteorologist Mark Bean Cuso, and on this day in weather history, September 19, 1967, Hurricane Beulah deluged Brownsville, Texas. The system started on September 5th east of the Lesser Antilles in the Intertropical Convergence Zone. Within a week, it was packing Category 5 strength and moved over the Yucatan. It made landfall in northeast Mexico with winds near 160 miles per hour, but weakened before striking Texas. A 20-foot storm surge slammed Padre Island upon landfall. The force of the storm tide made 31 cuts completely through the barrier island. The town of South Padre Island recorded the highest sustained wind at 136 miles per hour. Slow movement of Beulah led to significant flooding. The lower Rio Grande Valley was overwhelmed with torrential rains. Over 36 hours, 27 inches of rain fell. President Lyndon B. Johnson declared 24 counties in South Texas a disaster area. It produced 115 twisters, destroyed property, and inflicted serious damage on the region's agricultural industry. Beulah caused over $1 billion in damage and was the only major hurricane of the 1967 Atlantic hurricane season. 43 years ago, I'm Mark Mancuso.